Hey everybody, I'm Dave Kaufman and uh, I've been doing YouTube for several years now. So one of the things that you should keep in mind when you're first starting YouTube, a good rule of thumb when you're going to market and you're going to share your video on Facebook groups and on Twitter is to do it within you know, maybe three hours after you upload. That'll give your subscribers the first opportunity to watch your video. And so about three hours after you upload, go and bomb the other sites uh, and market your upload. And now that's gonna have a shelf life of the end of the day. It's not gonna last very long because so many people are uploading things to social media. So go back three days later and bomb it again. The second thing is consistency. When I first started, I would upload once a month. Sometimes I'd skip a month, go upload you know, once every other month. And I really believe that in the long term that hurt my channel because not only did YouTube recognize my channel as not anything viable, um, but nobody really knew when I uploaded and you want to create that community with your audience. So think about it like a television network. So every Wednesday night at 7 p.m., this show is on. You have to think in those kinds of terms when you start your YouTube channel. So the best thing to do is to pick a day and pick a time and never miss that upload. The second thing is, is that to, you know, aid you in being that consistent is to think as far in advance as you possibly can from, you know, your upload this week. Have a calendar on every upload day, figure out what video you're going to upload for at least two months in advance. You can, you know, film those on a Saturday and upload those on a Wednesday film eight videos on a Saturday afternoon and then just upload them every Wednesday or Thursday or whatever your upload day is, but it will really help you remain consistent if you have that two months in advance of knowledge of what you're going to upload. So consistency is the key to building your YouTube community. Another thing that I wish that I would have known before I started YouTube was how to market my channel and that is the hardest thing to do because Everybody is spamming Facebook, everybody's spamming Instagram, but uh, I would create an actual Facebook page for your channel. So let's say you have a fishing channel. I would create a channel on, or a, a page on Facebook with your channel name, get people to like that page, and then use that page to market every time that you upload. So again, number one, consistency a day and a time. Number two is think as far ahead as you possibly can. Number three is marketing. If you start off your YouTube channel and keep those three things in mind, chances are your YouTube channel is gonna grow at an upward pace and you're gonna have success on YouTube. Mm -hmm.